Lady Nika, this about you. And I'm about to pull you by your fake ass George Washington teeth hole. All I've been doing is being supportive to you when you have always been out here villainizing me. Yes, I accepted your apology. But guess what, bitch? You still doing fuck ass shit. When you want to throw me off your platform, bitch. When you want to throw me off your damn platform. Ho, you look like a motherfucking pumpkin. Bitch, that's what you look like. If we're going to be honest, you look like a damn pumpkin, bitch. A, you look like a damn pumpkin, bitch. A pumpkin on Halloween is what you look like. But see, I was trying. Allie, hey girl. I was trying to be cordial. But a motherfucker can't be cordial with you. Because you worried about every motherfucking thing else. And Allie, that's another thing. You. Allie over here trying to support a bitch. Zulu, chill. Allie over here trying to support a bitch that ain't never supported Allie. Go figure. After opportunity, I said, Jay Dunn, just don't make this about you today. Jay Dunn, this ain't about you today. Jay Dunn, let these people get some help. These folks didn't have a catastrophic fucking hurricane come through and fuck they shit up. Some of these people could not even survive this shit, Jay Dunn, is what I said. But you gotta have everybody eyes on you. It's gotta be all about you. Jaden, I was abused. I ain't wearing that on my sleeves. I have an abuser walking around me all the goddamn time. I'm not wearing that shit on my motherfucking sleeve. So what make you think that I'm gonna let you turn every one of my goddamn live streams into a story about you? Bitch, this channel says Lady Nika. Three times do not even relate to this motherfucking decade. But you want to tell me about what I could talk about, bitch. Fuck out of here with that bullshit. With the bullshit that done happened up in my life. But meanwhile, you give a old nasty, old nasty story time. About some shit that happened to you in 1938. Bitch, we don't give a damn about what happened to you in 1938. And if people can't give a damn about what happened to me in 2020 and 2021, then why do we need to give a damn about what happened to you in 1938? It's nothing you can put out here, Jay Dunn, on me that I ain't already had put out here on me. I'm not like you wearing a license. I know how to press a beer. You the one got a problem with it. You the one that walks around a tragedy all motherfucking day. You the one want people to feel sympathy for you all the goddamn time. You the one take every opportunity that you fucking get to make shit about you. This ain't have nothing to do with you. And I was calm, I was kind. I was understanding. I let you keep doing this shit over and over and over again. You don't move on from shit. If everybody in this B sector surrounded you and said, Jadon, we understand. Bambi's a bad person. She tried to abuse you. You were done wrong. Intrusion. I gave you a whole week of my show letting you get up on here and talk about some shit that I don't give no fucks about. I let you make it about you because I wanted you to feel like somebody gave a fuck on YouTube about you. But bitch, you are not going to threaten me. I am 50 motherfucking years old and ain't no pissy tail little girl gonna come at me like I'm some goddamn child. I ain't got time for your wishy-washy, your back and forth bullshit because I'm sick of the bullshit that you trying to feed me because I ain't your kids. You can't feed me no shit. You might have been feeding them shit.
while you was over there having to shop in Marshalls with Sean Bradley and James Caldwell, but you ain't gonna feed me no motherfucking bullshit. And I'm tired of it. You didn't think I was. What's good, OG? You didn't think I was. Oh, yes, I'm tired of it. Because all I see is that you claiming that you trying to give me some grace. What? Give me grace about what? But how dare you think that this is going to be about you? You gonna get over there and talk shit about me? Ain't now bitch raised me from no dead. I was over in the entertainment section and I was summoned to come back over here to the bottom of the motherfucking bear where I've been fucking stuck ever since I came over here and trying my best to make lemonade out of motherfucking lemons. Susan don't have no hold over me, j Dunn. She got one over you because you can't let go. Peace and all this. You still want to try to humiliate a bitch. And see, I ain't got time for that. Especially not whenever you are the one with the humiliating life, bitch. Where the fuck is the restaurant that you said that you owned since I first saw your raggedy ass on here? Where? Bitch, where? Bitch, that restaurant don't exist. None of the motherfucking bullshit exists, ho. Talking to you keep making little videos and snapping at me when I'm your biggest ally on this bitch. You can't shame me about my past, J Dunn, because I don't mean And you can't motherfucking... shame me about mine. I didn't ask you, I don't give a damn about your past. It's calling for you. Right, so that's why I'm here. And I want what? to know from you, J. Dunn, who the hell do you think you are to threaten a 50-year-old woman? I got when, a daughter, yo. When, when, when did I threaten you? J. Dunn, you've been saying for the last couple of days when I kind of, when I sit there and I kind of tell you no and don't let you go, you would have said you don't have a problem with me, but I, you can. What the fuck that means, J. Dunn?